coming back with another Kabumon video. This time we're gonna be doing the top 10 coolest Pokemon available in Kabumon. These are a mixture of legendaries, regular Pokemon, just ones that I thought were really cool. If your Pokemon doesn't make it out here, doesn't mean it's not cool. These are just my personal opinion. So let's get into it with number 10. All right, with number 10, we're gonna have Go Lurk. Look at the design on this guy. They did a wonderful, wonderful job. He is amazing looking and it's one of my favorites and that's a good start with it. Oh my god, why is he so close? <laughs> yeah, so really cool Pokemon. Look at him walk. Look at his little strut. Pretty cool. Alright, number nine, we're gonna have all the Eevee evolutions. Um, so let's go ahead and look first with Eevee. Look at how cute he is. They did a really great job on that little sprite. And look how cute he is. So that's Eevee. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and do Flareon right here. So look at Flareon, they did a wonderful job on this one as well. Really took your time and made it look like a real awesome Flareon. Um, right here we got Jolteon, one of my favorite Pokemon, especially the shiny. I know a lot of people hate it since it's like green, but I think it looks really cool. Um, we got Vaporeon, the infamous Vaporeon. Really cool, really nice. Uh, let's see if it'll make it walk over here. Yeah, look how cute it is. Um, we got Glaceon. It did also a wonderful job on this one. Look at this one. Wow. Let's see if it'll come over here. Yeah, look at her. So cute. And then we got Leafeon. Again, really great job on the way they look. And yeah, this one's one of my favorites as well. Then we got Espeon, really cool one as well. Look at those ears, they are huge. Let's see if we can make it walk towards us. Yeah, look at it, ah, it's so cute. Yeah, so now we got Umbreon, look at the little walk, look at his little rings, really cool. Uh, and I love the shiny, that was number nine. All right, so number eight is gonna be everyone's favorite, Dragonite. Look at the way the Dragonite sits, really awesome. I wish you could ride Pokemon in this mod. Um, and he flies super cool. Sir, what are you doing? You cannot be up here. Look at him. Number nine. Let's see if he'll come over here. <laughs> Look at him. Stop following me! Look at him. Just one gorgeous dragon Pokemon. Yeah, I wish you could ride it. You could press like right click on him and then you could like ride it and you just take off into the sky. Really cool Pokemon. Really well done. And that is why it sits at number eight. At number seven, we actually have one of the coolest ones, I think, in this list. It is it does sit a little bit low just because um there's some better ones out there, but look at how cool this one is. It also flies. I don't know why he's doing that. Let's see if he'll make him come over here. Look at look at this. Look at this. This is like stuff out of nightmares. Look at this. Look at this. Ah. Yeah, really cool Pokemon. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at him. Wow. Yeah, this one's really well done. Extremely terrifying the way it runs. So do not run away from a guard chomp. He will chomp your head off. That was number seven. At number six, we have Mew. Mew, really cute Pokemon. Obviously, um, the design is just, you know, it looks like a Mew, but I think he's so cute the way he floats like that. Look at him. How can you not like this little guy? And you can find these pretty much uh, in forest and you don't have to do anything special. So this one, you know, keep a lookout if you're playing Kabumon. You never know where you're gonna find a Mew. For number five, we're gonna have Lucario. Lucario, really great Pokemon, really strong Pokemon. I love him in the anime and in all the movies. Um, here, he looks awesome. And I can't believe I actually got one in my Kabumon series. So if you have not started my Kabumon series and you're just watching this video for the first time, Go ahead and click the link that I'm gonna post right now um, so you can see me catch this Lucario. We are, I believe, on episode 20. Um, and yeah, we already had Lucario. I think this is episode like 13 that we got him on. So yeah, definitely um, take a look at the couple of my videos. Um, and yeah, this is number five. On number four, we're gonna have the three legendary birds. I just could not decide, so I grouped them all into one. Uh, you decide which one is the best one. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, this is Articuno right here. Really beautiful, gorgeous bird. Look at him. That's just awesome. Like I said, I wish you could ride them. That would be amazing to soar into the sky on Articuno. Let's go ahead and take a look at Moltres. This is Moltres right here. Fire chicken, I love him. Really cool. This has a great shiny as well. And uh, let's take a look at Zapdos. Zapdos, whoa, look at Zapdos. 
yeah it's not those probably the better one out of all of them if i'm gonna say it although my favorite is articuno but in Kabumon, Zapdos just looks so cool. And that was number four. For number three, we are gonna have Mewtwo, the super strong Mewtwo. Look at him, he also floats. Really, really cool. Um, there's better ones out there, but I just have to have Mewtwo on here. He's just like, you know, such an iconic Pokemon. And I think they did a great job here in Kabumon. Yeah, number three, Mewtwo. Number two, Walking Away. So this one's from the Scarlet and Violet series. Look at them, it's like a Suicune alternate form. Um, really crazy, crazy design. Let's go ahead and put them back so we can walk towards us right here. Just look at them, look at, look at how massive it is. I want you guys to see how big he really truly is. Um, just, just look at him, just look at him, just gorgeous. And that's why he sits at the number two spot. Really awesome. Definitely one of the coolest Pokemon that you can get on here. Um, and yeah, look, look at him. Nobody can stop in your way if you got this behind your back. Let's see how it runs. Yeah, not as terrifying as, Gar oh my gosh. Not as terrifying as Garchomp, but still really, really awesome. All right, so we got number one. It has to be Rayquaza, Rayquaza, however you want to say it. Uh, in Kabumon, they did an amazing job. This is what he looks like. He's gigantic, really awesome. Did a great job on the colors. I wish you could ride it. I say that a lot about a lot of these Pokemons on the top 10 coolest ones. Um, but yeah, Rayquaza is a monster, and I believe you get this one at the end game from an egg, I believe. Uh, or you might have to fight it. I don't know. We are not that far into Kabumon yet. Hopefully, in the future, we can get this far and catch ourselves a Rayquaza or Rayquaza. But yeah, that was our top 10 coolest Pokemon. A quick little Pokemon video. If your Pokemon didn't make it on here, um, it might make it in future ones. So definitely let me know what I should do next for a top 10 video. If you have any ideas, I would gladly make them. Um, so thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys on the next one.